Hello ladies and gents, my name is Brooke and today, this is a weird intro and I'm just not gonna stop. Today we're gonna be talking about some YouTuber pet peeves that I have as a YouTuber myself. I have been doing YouTube now for I think like, three and a half years and um, I think I have a right to get annoyed at things other people do, things that I do that I'm editing and I'm just like, thumbnail. <laughs> peeve I have surrounding YouTube and YouTubers is when they say you guys is or your guys is. Now I definitely can say first off that I have done this many times before I'm certain because what else do you say? You know how you say like um you know my friend's puppy or something but if you want to say like you guys is puppy like that's not English like you, like what do you say you know what I mean like whenever someone says this in a vlog in just a normal YouTube video or something or I say it I'm just like that's wrong but like what's the right way I guess like it'd just be like instead of apostrophe S it's just like all of your dogs it's just one of those things that I just I think to myself what a wonderful world no, for real. It's just one of those things that I just literally have no idea of the actual proper English term. And if any of you guys know, and I'm just completely like pfft, oblivious, let me know because I've actually thought about this like in depth a lot. Now the next thing that bothers the crap out of me, I need to demonstrate for you guys. This bothers the crap out of me. Now it never did and then I saw someone else talk about this, whether it was in a Snapchat or a video or something, and I was like, that is actually very frustrating. This. You're talking the entire time and that little puppy dog filter tongue thing just like keeps popping out. That bothers me. But what bothers me more is when they have the sound on. Hey guys, like I'm doing a Snapchat right now and this is awesome because I want to tell you about this new product I just got. I can't with people who do that. Okay, so if you ever do a Snapchat story vlog kind of thing. I do those quite often. If you don't follow me on Snapchat, follow me. But it bothers me when people leave the sound on for one, but then also just use a puppy dog filter when they're talking. Now, if you can manage to talk without the little tongue thing popping out, A plus, use that filter all the doo day. But when it happens, I get angry. Oh my God, because I just am just like watching it happen and just like, oh my God. <laughs> Another thing that bothers me personally when I'm editing my own videos is the amount of times I say um. Now I do say like a little too much I would say, but I say um and so yeah. So and yeah. All the time. And this is like more of a personal one like I said because I'm editing a video and I'll just be going through it and it'll be something along the lines of so I bought this new sweater today and um so yeah like I don't really know like it's just a sweater from um where did I get this? Um, for 21 and it's just super cute and yeah, I don't know, like that's pretty much it. Super, super cute. <laughs> like that is so bothersome, oh my god. So I literally recently, whenever I'm editing my videos, I just, can we just discuss this? Oh my god, I like inhaled on my own air. I don't know, it wasn't a good thing, bad thing. So it just bothers the crap out of me, honestly, because Whenever I'm editing my own videos now, I just see that happening. And I know this video is just going to be a prime example of it because there's no possible way I'm just gonna all of a sudden stop using all these like filler words. So just bear with me, but like just know, no matter how many times you might see it in a video, there are 10 times the amount of those words that I just cut out because it was too much. So yeah, I did not mean, I did not mean to do that. Now this is one I've definitely discussed a little bit before, but it's when people comment on my channel now, well I guess not just in general commenting on my channel, you'll hear it in a second. Basically, long story short, I have relatively a smaller channel, so whenever people comment I get super excited and I love whenever I can, you know, comment back to someone about the topic of the video, or just thanking that person about whatever they commented, or honestly whatever they were talking about. But when I get those, like for example, hey my name is Sally Bob. And I just wanted to say, great video. I love the hairstyles you showed. Please subscribe to my channel and maybe we can do a collab in the future. Definitely loved this video again. Great work, hun. A lot of things going on with Sally Bob here. First of all, don't ever do that self-promo on 
other people's channels. I think I've done it one time. So everyone definitely goes through a phase, I'm not gonna lie, but my phase was one video, okay? Some people's phases are like copy and paste for years. Now I have actually caught people doing this before and like gone to other videos and seen them posting that same exact thing on other people's videos and I'm just like, there's just a lot of things wrong with this whole situation because one, YouTube most likely will just send that to spam. So the amount of people that will see that is literally zero. And if they don't, the YouTuber will probably delete that comment, send it to spam, report it, something along those lines. Personally, I don't really do anything. If it's, you know, goes to spam, great. If it doesn't, I don't touch it. But I know some people definitely would. And also, what annoys the crap out of me as well is when people comment that and they don't actually see the video, if you're going to comment something along those lines, actually watch the video because there have been millions of times where people comment something along the lines of, like I said, great hairstyles or loved the makeup look and I'm literally doing like a clothing haul and I never mention like different hairstyles or like I'm not wearing makeup in the video and maybe the video is like about not wearing makeup and they're like, great makeup look, like what do you mean? I just like will start twitching and I'm just like, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Also, another thing that bothers me, this is just more like a random, not really YouTube related thing. It might be, I don't know. I hate when people who don't know me, or, and especially when they're like around my age, whether they're a few years younger, a few years older, whatever, call me hun. Another YouTuber pet peeve I have, by the way, there is like no script for this. I'm holding my phone, but like I don't have a list or anything, so I'm really impressed with myself because. Or maybe I'm just really angry. I wouldn't necessarily call it impressed. Another thing that bothers me is when people have their background music on their channels too loud to where it's basically the exact same sound as them talking so you can't hear what they're saying or it's just too distracting. This happens all the time on so many people's videos and I'm just watching it and I'm like, I would love to hear what you're saying. It seems to be a great video, just can't understand you. And another thing that bothers me about YouTubers, oh my god, I love YouTube by the way. I would just like to say that I really do love it, but you know, I hate when people do things like this. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooke. I don't understand the appeal to that. I don't understand why people do that. Another thing that bothers me about YouTubers, I don't know if I would necessarily say that this one is something that bothers me or makes me mad or I don't know or if it's just in general like something I personally don't do I don't really have an opinion it doesn't genuinely make me mad it just kind of makes me raise an eyebrow a little bit I don't like when people call their subscribers fans now I'm sure other people have opinions maybe you might say well if someone has like millions and millions of subscribers clearly they have fans okay that is your own idea that is your own opinion behind it completely fine no issues with it but personally for me I don't like that I don't know I mean I guess like what's different between somebody who has a lot of followers on YouTube compared to like an actor in a movie like they have fans why can't youtubers I know it's just something personally to me that whenever someone says it just kind of cringe at it and I really can't explain why I guess to me youtubers and like YouTube in general is always more of like an interactive space. It's like two friends are talking compared to something else and maybe that's why it kind of bothers me. I don't really know. I can't necessarily tell for certain but whenever I hear someone say like oh my fans and like they're doing a Q&A or maybe reading a comments video and just like call people fans. It's one thing if people like call themselves a fan like oh my god I'm such a fan of you you're my favorite youtuber or whatever that's one thing it doesn't bother me whatever people say about their favorite youtubers whatever but when youtubers address their following as a fan or a fandom or something it's just like so I would say that's pretty much all of my pet peeves surrounding YouTube and youtubers let me know in the comments below if you have any pet peeves about YouTube that I did not mention and I could always do a part two to this. I don't think I've ever made one of these and if I have then this is already the part two and I could do a part three. I don't really know but thank you guys so so much for watching. I love you to pieces and please be sure to subscribe, comment thumbs up and all that jazz and I will see you guys in the next video. I definitely switched up my emphasis on the words. It's fine. Okay. Bye guys.